Hey, we're here. Ooh, we're still on the options menu. And we're entering the gungeon. Uh, ooh, we have to go to the options menu because I need to change the save that we're on. We're on save slot A. Yeah, let's confirm that. Do I coincidentally also have eight hegemony credits with that save? No, we only have two. Okay. All right, so <clears throat> let's start Marine. Let's just go around the horn. A little loud in my ears. Hopefully it's not a little loud on the stream. So we've been, I have been playing a metric ton of this game. Oh yeah, this guy. Um, on my own, because I've been enjoying it immensely. Uh, and because I want to get good, uh, as the kids say. So get, get good we shall. Get, get, anyway. Dark Souls. <clears throat> I also posted up the first uh, week, uh, or first episode, or two weeks ago show, basically, on the YouTube channel. Finally, if you've been looking for it. You know what? The game is still, oops, the game is still a little loud. I'm going to turn down my ears just a little more and then hope that it is not too loud on stream. And then maybe turn it down in game a little bit. I had the, the game volumes way down because uh, while I was playing, I was listening to music. And I turned the minimal and then I was talking with friends on Skype. And this is. So. Been getting better at reloading. Uh, upon leaving a room and whoops I thought you were gonna die you did not you lived you lived on and um, I'm still not I still have a little bit of too good to use syndrome when it comes to a blank my dodge rolls have been getting better oh we shouldn't have came up from behind that table um, yeah, I feel some marked improvement. Uh, I've yet to uh, polish the game off from a uh, number of fours completed perspective. Oh, but um, I've made it to the fifth floor a handful of times. I've made it to the third and fourth floors pretty consistently. So I just got to remember back to those early Isaac days when um, getting to mom wasn't a given. <laughs> Just because the, uh, the old reflexes weren't there and the knowledge wasn't there either. Jeez, get out of here. I mean, something similar to me even happened in Isaac. I think I talked about this before, but um, right before, no, after. It was after the release of Rebirth. Um, there was an update to the Flash version by the uh, co-designer of that. Or co-creator. I think he did all the coding. Edwin McMillan is more of a... Uh, like level design art guy not so much with the coding from what I understand I could be wrong about that but anyway um, he released this update called uh, eternal mode which added a more difficult mode to the original Binding of Isaac and also introduced a handful of achievements which I of course had to go back and earn um, and the, if you have the game, I really suggest you try out the Eternal mode if you haven't. It's been out for, like, it's been, I want to say, like, on the order of years since it was released. So, um, oh, that was very close. I looked away for a second and felt the breeze of a bullet going by me. 
Um, hey, another health. There's our water barrel. Keep that intact. And uh, anyway, it adds a bunch of eternal versions of enemies. They're they're very white, like eternal hearts. It's like a has this whole eternal heart theme to it. Um, and those enemies are brutally unfair. Uh, and there could be there can even be eternal bosses. So. I remember playing, like, ah, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'll just breeze through this in a couple hours, and then five runs in, having, like, not made it past Mom's heart, going like, okay, we have made a mistake. <laughs> Let's unlock that secret. Let's give it a whirl. It's the worst that could happen. Did we not get the... Oh, there it is off of that room. Good. So. There were some really cool, really, really cool things in that eternal mode. And eventually, it, it just became... I mean, there was an added difficulty of... Um, uh, I don't know if money for the iron coin, probably I'm going to buy a key later. Um, yeah, difficulty, the fact that it was the Flash version, and I've been playing Rebirth for a while, which, uh, plays a lot tighter. Nope, I am not, oops, I am not kneeling at the ammo altar when I have no guns that require ammo, so. Alright, here we go. Now we got the Trigger Twins. As always, let's start on Shades. Actually, we usually start on Smiley, huh? Well, I don't appreciate that. Okay, that crowd control. Oh, we we did it. We did it. Oh, damn it. I was ju just about to blank, but I was walking to the left, and I find that on keyboard mouse, walking to the left makes it impossible to blank effectively. One almost down. There we go. Once you get one out of the way, it's pretty much just matter of course to uh, make that two. Whoops! That was my bad. At this point, it doesn't matter, though. Like, any any damage we take is just water under the bridge here. Probably gonna get it back immediately. Let's just... That's not a, a reason to take all the damage in the world. Oh, got a little close there, huh? There we go. Not overly, uh, not overjoyed about my performance on that boss, but we are back to full health. We did get a great weapon in the Mega Hand. Um, no keys, so we're just going to go back and shoot some chests and uh, head down to the Secret Four, because why not? Yeah, brown chests are the worst. Uh, we found a little found a little bit about the hierarchy of chests. Um, with like I said, brown being the worst, next being blue, then green, um, then black, and then red. So All right, down we go. The P, uh, the Mega Hand is pretty good on, uh, pretty good on bosses. So we're gonna probably just continue using the the sidearm here for room clearing purposes. Whoa, okay. Mm. 
We did it. Yeah, we ever got hit there. Oh, that veteran. Leading his shots like a pro. You know, I thought these guys were wearing cowboy hats. No, they're just blown out. They're just peeled back like a banana. Because they exploded. But I saw a cowboy hat. I got that veteran shotgunner out of the way. Well, that's not fun. Oh, well, knocked that guy into the drink. <clears throat> Taking way too much damage so far. Unexcusable damage at that. Stupid table. We got one casing for clearing that room. Hopefully there's a, a guy to sell stuff to. Nope. Uh, Anvilin? No. I don't think any of, that, any of those things are particularly worth it. So, moving on. These guys are supposed to be poop. According to the uh, Ammo Namacon. No, you're not too bad. Yeah, roll through that poison. Make sure that guy keeps walking in it. <laughs> that worked out okay. Not a mimic, which is good. Kind of got a little lucky with that guy's death explosion, which I totally forgot was going to happen. I don't know what killed that little slime fella, but I'm glad he died without hurting me. Ooh, do you see the quality of chest on the map now? That's handy dandy. I don't know if there was an update for that. Ooh. I hear that poop spinning. He can keep on spinning way far away from me. Still have not wrapped my head around the way those bullets move. They curve around. Alright, let's go. Another blue chest. Also not a mimic. Unfortunately, nothing to light that fuel. Like that veteran to die. There he goes. Get those mutated ones out of here. Oh god, it's a ghost. You son of a bitch. I don't think he should have been able to adjust his aim at that speed. Feel like you should have had to trail a little bit longer. No matter, some more. All right, not too bad so far. Hey, a key. We have to open a box, maybe. Thank you. Appreciate you blowing up your friend there at the start of this room. Made it, everything quite easier. I'm not for sure he'd be dead. All right, this guy. Leave that till the end. Who? 
Oop, this guy's in trouble. The water, yeah, it's like whatever liquid. I, if you put the water down after tipping that uh, brazier, the water pushes the fire out of the way. So, oh, you spawned in the fire, you jerk. Taking too much damage, man. Back around full circle here. Uh, all right. Let's see what we got in here. Got like a shotgun coffee. Speed up. All right. Fair enough. That's not what I wanted. I wanted to take a look at the shop. See if we get a uh, little heart for sale here. We do. I'm gonna take one. One half heart. I'm assuming that this is going to be our boss. Oh, there's another room. Alright. Not too bad so far. Get this mushroom out of here. I hate these... These enemies that are left. Whoa. These guys. Dislike them greatly. Their shot pattern's kind of random. And they have an invincibility period. Yeah, spend your time throwing up instead of shooting at me. Play right into my hands. Oh, you know what? There's an option I wanted to turn down. Gameplay screen shake. Let's cut that down quite a bit. I hear it is better for people who are watching if the screen shake is a bit lower, so. Oh, come on. Can never take your eyes off the bullets. That is the lesson of this game. Whoops. Yeah, bring it on back in. That's right, it's not like we get a uh, reward for perfecting this guy. Boom. Done. Not too bad. We got hit once, which is unfortunate. We got the kiln. Fires pots. It really does. Alright, we get these uh, nice hegemony credits here. Might as well open up our other blue box could be worth it could have a uh, Winchester in it which is not too bad uh, I'm looking for this we can use the uh, Winchester for rooms all right and we have uh, this one bit of armor that we are going to try to protect for an extremely long time. But floor two is uh, usually a little easier than floor 1.5, so. Ho! Oh, a veteran. I didn't know we could get veterans on this floor, to be honest. 
Yeah, the name of the game is Don't Get Hit. Oh, this thing has an okay rate of fire. Okay. We're in there. Whoa. Get out of here. I am more scared of those bullet things than this cube. Especially since the cube is gone. Alright, so we actually needed that health up. I hope I didn't leave health on the last four that I could have used. Potion of gun friendship, not particularly interested in. I hear that they fixed the sell price of junk, which will be great if we can get the junk to drop into the dang sewer. Don't know why this is so difficult. There it is. We got three. We got three again. I've seen people get 50. Oh, uh, well. Maybe it's either it's still broken or maybe it's just a random chance. Whoa. Oh, nice try, buddy. Reload time on this thing is a little lengthy. Right, yeah, maybe if I didn't reload it so often. Hello! He got an extra one just because. Now we're almost out of ammo for this. Ooh, there's a veteran. Tell by his eye patch and gnarled outlook on life. We got all our ammo back. Oh, damn. I'll buy a key to get to that NPC. Yeah, it didn't look like a mimic. Any keys for sale? Ah, one. Which is perfect for uh, what I'm looking to do. Which is open that door. Let's see who we got. Oh, it's uh, this guy. Yeah, let's help him map. Sweet. Alright. Uh, you know, probably faster to port here. I mean, we're going to explore the whole floor anyway. Why not get a prize for doing what you're already going to do? <laughs> Very nice. There's our boss. Okay. Thought for sure he was going to take two shots. Damn it. Just hide here for a moment. Ha ha! Little, little fun gunplay there. Always the last direction you go. And I wonder if that is by design. That, hmm, we, we need to investigate that, I think. Really? That was it? Is there ammo for any other gun? No, we're full up on everything. And if I leave the room, the ammo vanishes, so... We're 
keeps you going. Yeah, you're done. There you are. Thanks for putting yourself in that nice corner. Oh, God! That's a scary place for him to be. Okay, he's alive. That's a different one. <laughs> I'm just going to hang out over here for a second while these guys get all charged up. Blast themselves into a wall. Very nice. All right, it's kind of got to be off this room, right? No? Well, then it's got to be off of this room? We did it! We get to, um place the crest on the altar and uh, let's do two things let's um, you don't look like a mimic but I don't trust chests let's just shoot, let's just shoot this thing you got junk that's fine we're gonna go to the shop and sell that junk while the selling is good um, here seems to be an okay place to stand. Three again. And then we're going to go here. Talk to this fellow. The map is complete. Laser sight. Nice. Aim up. Alright, and then uh, let's go try... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I wanted to go up and see this statue, uh, this shrine. A shrine to the gun gods. I think we can offer a tribute. Bullets from nowhere. Pop, bullets from nowhere. All right, it seems to get more and more expensive as you go. Um, let's go fight our boss. Honestly, let's. I just want to see how the Winchester does on the boss. It's the uh, Ammo Conda. Well, there goes any hopes of uh, not getting hit on this boss. Oh, come on. No! Ah! Oh. I don't think that was the right guy. I wouldn't even use the pot gun. That stinks. Alright. I'm going to throw it and unlock the box. Alright, let's... Oh, I hit space. We're going to return to the breach. We're going to hit escape return to the breach. <sighs> Damn. I feel like I, I let you down. Because I have been doing better. Maybe we're just warming up. That's what it is. We're just warming up. We're just getting back into the swing. Hot lead. Uh, yeah, I'll do the heart lunch box. Health ups are pretty important. Aeroconda is pretty nuts also. I need to watch myself a little better in that. A lot of grenades. So now we're playing as the pilot. I hope there wasn't a water barrel in this room. Or maybe the, the Winchester wasn't the right call. Move this out of the way. Yes, we did it. What? Oh. That barrel just broke. And I don't know why. Oh, 
Okay, that was really close. We made it work. Happy the knight is down there. Whoops, don't fire into the wall. Come on, cut on the lookout for another water barrel here. Oh, maybe we're boned. Maybe no uh, secret floor on this go. Always get lucky with a water weapon. That is not a water weapon. I'm trying to think if there are any good water weapons, and I honestly don't know. Alright, any room with just one enemy, I guess, is not too bad. Um, ah, you don't... We have the lockpick. Let's just lockpick this chest. If it doesn't open, I mean, we probably weren't going to open it anyway. Hey, it did. And we got a regular shotgun. Cocked and locked. Let's use this for a little bit. This guy. Oh, oh, okay. I accidentally bought this table tech. I think this is the one that you flip a table and blanks happen. Yeah. All right. Is there a secret room in here? Didn't seem to be. I mean, it's a really good table tech, but I was kind of just cycling through his speech. Let's see if he had anything interesting to say. Yep, these guys are all... They were all bullets committing suicide. No, I put the tables, jerk. Yeah, no tables here to flip. Ha! And around this way. Say this room probably isn't finished. Again, still on the lookout for that for another water barrel. I heard glass breaking, but that wasn't water pouring all over the floor, so I don't Don't know why that one barrel broke, but Hey, two in a row. Great. Does that tell me anything? Is that a secret room? Is that what you're telling me? There's a secret room down here? There is. Sweet. All right, the uh, the charmed bow. Chance to charm enemies. Don't know what that is. Let's go with the shotgun for now. Ah, the bullet king.
no way we were getting out of that, so... Oh. As long as all the bullets are hitting, I'm fine. Go! Yes! Alright! I think the Bullet King is arguably the easiest boss. We got another table tech? We did. Two table techs. Is not a bad way to run around. That is for sure. Alright. Let's take a little time to look for another water barrel. It may be worth our while. I think the charm bow is what we're going to use for rooms for a little bit. <laughs> um, yeah. Don't think there's one in the entrance. This is where it is. I don't think there can be a water barrel in the room with the fireplace. Alright, screw it. Let's just go. Let's just go. It's okay. We don't have to do the secret four every time. <clears throat> Main reason I do it is to get better at the game. There we go. Kind of disappointed that didn't one hit. Hey! <laughs> I'm actually extremely disappointed with the amount of damage this weapon is doing. I guess this weapon is relying on its personality. Also, I guess if this weapon killed everything instantly, but still charmed, it would be pretty dumb. I prefer enemies that just die. No! Ah. Hey, a secret room. Alright, we'll take a, uh... We'll take a free chest. That just had a health in it. That's fine. Well, I do appreciate the, uh, utility of the charm bow. I think, uh... Killing power is more what I'm in the market for. Get stunned. <laughs> Get all those bullets out of here. Pretty good. You can rack up those table techs, man, and get a lot done. Sudden enemies, firing blanks, our tables are out of control. Ha! That veteran out of here. No, we're doing okay. A door that requires a key.
with a uh, little NPC behind it. We got some keys. Let's go. Ooh. Ricochet game. Break the targets. Win a prize. All right, straight shooter. Good luck. All right, let's do it. Want to... Uh... Okay, pretty good there. This is one that I messed up before. Not that time. Oh, so far so good. One more to go. Get this as straight as we can. It's like one pixel over and that's fine. Nailed it. Look at that. Got them all. Claim your prize, Deadeye. Look at that. A big old chest. Best chest. And it has in it Thunderclap Lightning in a Bullet. Let's use it right away. Uh, because we didn't use the pot gun. And I feel that was an error. Just because, you know, we got a new gun, we should use it. You guys are probably like, oh, can't wait to see those pots go fire. And I'm like, let me hold off on that. It was just poor play on my part. Uh, what's this guy do? Gun bullet. Alright. Whoa! Can then we ooh, charge this gun up? Nope. Seems pretty good. This gun seems okay. Probably uh, if we get a pool of water down there, I'll make some good people dance. All right, we're just gonna use the uh, the lock pick. Maybe because I didn't want to use a key on a brown chest. Them being the uh, the worst of the chests. Okay. Oh, I set up this way. Yeah, I wonder if the uh, if the level is procedurally generated the moment you enter it, or if it is generated as you explore it. Because I have seen games with both that do it both ways, so. Hey, a little guy to sell our junk to. Drop it in. Nope. One day I'll get lucky, and he'll throw out 50 by mistake. It's kind of open for a gun muncher. I mean, I guess we could sell the bow, but I'd rather hold it for munching opportunities. Ooh. The reload on this is not lightning quick, that is for sure. Ah, I see a green chest. Now that's something I'm willing to spend just a key on. Ooh, what is this? Looks like a heart. It gives a heart container. Heart of ice. That's cold. Fires ice projectiles and taking damage. Uh, torn from a um, a frost giant. Favorite amongst monster hunters. Hey, right, we're just gonna use the, we're gonna use the thunderclap. Ah, the beholster. Oh, we're doing okay. Let's just uh, blank that away. Oh, 
like to uh, get that crowd control. I'm to blank that again. And that's a perfectly acceptable course of action. Uh, oh, come on! Just trying to change guns. Oh. I got hit twice like a big dummy. We had that one in the bag, too. You got here. Betrayer's Shield. Actually a gun. Okay. Man, we were all set to have six health. We were right there. And I lost faith in my weapon. I don't even know what this guy wants. Oh, three armor. Ooh. Uh, I mean, we might be able to do it. Oh, does it put a shield up when you reload? Huh. Bad time to, uh, to to look, but let's look at this gun. I'm going to shield upon reload. Black knows his knight who may betrayed Sir Manuel, um, but he did not lose his gun. He did that much later. All right. I'm guessing that as long as a shield remains... Oh, God! That was so close. Say, so as long as a shield remains, another will not spawn, and that seems to be the case. Um, let's actually get ammo for the shotgun here. I'm going to keep using this. Oh, These enemies, man, those those fucking bouncy things. I hate them. These guys die. Deflect bullets off of them. Incredibly annoying. There's no tables to flip in here. Ooh, although there will be an NPC on this floor. Let's get that key. Got it. Save some more NPCs. shield right there. Aha! Alright, we did it. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, I thought there, for sure there was going to be another roller. Yeah, let's crack it open. Ah, the coin. Save that for a little bit. Oh, uh, maybe it was the elevator shaft on that on our last run when we got the map. No. <laughs> I gotta get better at reloading this gun. No, you don't.
Apparently blanks do a little bit of damage. I didn't realize that. Alright, we're tearing through uh, ammo for this gun. I'm okay with that, to be honest. Ooh. The, uh... Oh, my lord. What? Are you kidding? Stray bullet just ran right into us. It is nice how you can shoot through the shield and they can't. Oop, empty. Get stunned. Get blanked and stunned. Another gun empty. That's me that you fired at, dick. There we go. Now we're back to the shotgun. Let's go. Whoa! That was close. Bottleneck him. Doing okay so far. Head to that shop. Oh, we got another guy to sell things. I might be okay with just buying a heart bottle, in all honesty. It sounds like an okay thing to do. Before we go spending all our money, let's uh, explore a little more. There we go. Let's, uh, found our boss. Let's see what else this floor has to offer first. Uh, this uh, little rigmarole. Yeah, I wish we could try out our electricity gun, but uh, we can't. It's out of ammo. Damn it. I am upset that I got hit there. Huh, ammo. What could we like? I mean, we could refill the Betrayer's shield. Or the thunderclap. Let's refill the thunderclap. Oh, God! I just walked into a pit like a genius. I'm going to try this electricity business now. Uh, the water dried up. Unfortunate. I flip a blank in, in disgust. It does! That was the time we used the real blank. Because that was getting tight. God, that gun stinks. I'm sure I may look back some video later and be like, oh my god, why did I say that stinks? But as of right now, that gun stinks. <laughs> yeah, perfect. We use it to charm this mimic if it is one, and it wasn't. But here's the NPC we're freeing. Oh, sweet. These guys. These guys are cool. They, uh, 
help tell us to hunt people basically they have a monster hunt quotas damn it thought I'd take a chance oh well yeah there's grab the health that's scattered around the floor and uh, go buy a health up bottle I think that's going to be an okay thing for us to do. Uh, the uh, the closest teleporter is not close at all for that. Alright, now we teleport here. I think it's boss time. Let's give the the four one last look. Yep, yep, yep. All right, time to fight the boss. Cannon Balrog, Cannon Balrog, and immediately we are hit twice. Use the blanks. One blank probably would have gotten me out of that situation. Choose the uh, control. All right, we're on the we're on the gun we want. Damn it. Damn it! <laughs> I am glad I bought that extra health. Where are you? There you are. Alright. I still haven't fought the uh, the bosses up at this this level that much, so... Clear, I still have a thing or two to learn about them. Alright. Nice. A lot of hits I'm not happy about on that fight, but we did it. Ooh, we got a pretty decent weapon in the stinger. Honestly, regular shotgun. Any more health line around the four? Nope. We're off the four four. Pretty good four to be on, I hear. Ah, uh, not everyone makes it there. Pretty exclusive. I saved the coin for the fifth four. Oh shit, I didn't even see that guy. <laughs> Alright, no such thing as too good to use down here. I want to figure this room out. Does that have anything to do with... Nope, no idea. I don't want to just go jumping into the abyss either. Okay. We can make this right. Just pay real close attention to what we're doing. Okay. We did it. Let's get a teleporter so we never have to go through that room again. Nope. 
This guy, I gotta wait for him to start shooting at us. And that's when we blow him away. Son of a bitch. Got him. I am okay with the amount of table flipping we did. Is this the shotgun coffee run? No, it isn't. We had that last run. <laughs> Can't remember the items I have run to run. I'm mad because I rolled that. Alright, that one I didn't. Whoa! I'd like it if these uh, spent casings stop coming out of nowhere. Thank you for the shotgun ammo. Sheesh. Someone told me there was more big old slidey blocks down there. No, you don't. Getting to this guy's a pain in the ass. Not so bad when you get up against a wall. That's enough out of you. Hey, key. <laughs> Just get away, please. The stun is really nice on top of that blank. Get off the edge! Apparently he can't be knocked off the edge. He can be killed though. It's the next best thing. Damn it. I, did not ex I don't know why I don't expect them to fire as quickly as they do, but they always fire that quickly. And it always catches me off guard. Right, green we will open. What is this? Ring of ethereal form. Get ethereal. Nope, that's a donation to our rat friend. Get better here. Let's do better. Whew. 
Whew. Running from cover to cover here. Alright, we did it. On to the next room. Ooh, where we don't dodge into bullets. God, these little zombie guys. What a pain. Alright. Doing okay. Oh, that was so close. What was that noise? I don't want to find out. Just die, please. I'd really like to find our shop soon. What's this now? Flame hand! <laughs> 2D6 plus int mod? Is this, uh, this is... Okay. Alright, I'll roll with it. Okay. Tell you something, man, I know about me. I flip tables. This is piercing fire damage, which I am okay with. No, you don't. Stop it right there. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, that blank table flipping is incredibly strong. I'll just rock this until it's done. I love this guy, how he f makes like a little D&D &D party to go after you. You gotta be out of ammo soon, ghost. Yeah, we need to uh, we need to change weapons there for a second. Winchester rifle is extremely good. Extremely good. How much is health? It doesn't matter. We're buying it. We're also buying this. I think we're going to uh, stick with the flame hand for a little bit. But when it gets to boss time, I think we're using that Winchester rifle. go. And the reason we're using this for rooms is that it's piercing and does burning damage. It's pretty much built for room clearing. Oh god! Get the get the D&D &D party away from me. Oh, it's the little fighter! He's on my ass! Oh, good. Alright, so that's done. Let's go back to the regular shotgun. Yeah. Alright, we got some okay value out of that thing. I don't think it was, like, the highest damage item. Only did 2d6. I don't know what my hit mod is, but I can't imagine it's very high. Alright. Winchester rifle. In we go. Ooh. These pillars. Oh no, the stinger! We're gonna use the stinger. Need to change weapons really fast. Hearts of stone, the kill pillars.
Go bees! I'm just firing in there. This is some kind of attack. Did we get one? We did! No! Oh, I could have blanked. Damn it. So close. We got one of the pillars. That was incredibly close. Our, head, our past still haunts us, but that's okay. Um, let's go back to the breach. That was a very long run. Let's go back to the breach uh, as the prisoner, and then we'll take our first break of the evening. Um, here we go. This is the... Ada, welcome to the stream, sir. Thank you for stopping by. Yes, one to the task. Outstanding. Bullet man. 200 bullet men, and then we return. Um, all right. So, uh, we're going to take our first break of the evening. If you're having a good time tonight, I encourage you to follow. So, you know, if I don't go live again, if you're watching this replay on YouTube, I encourage you to subscribe. Um, so, you know, if I when new videos are posted, you also find this, uh, find me on Facebook and Twitter right over there. And uh, we'll be right back after this very brief break. <laughs> 